action I've taken has been within Facebook, has been about Facebook, you know, has been about how do I get more traffic from Facebook. I've been sitting very patiently right. back there. Um, just so I'm clear, like a WordPress site, do yep. I recreate everything within Facebook or can I, do I just look for a, a, a WordPress theme that's 520 wide? You can, yeah, no, you can put WordPress themes yep. within it, yeah, um, and you would want, yes, that's a really good question. So look, look, look for a thing that's... That's 520 wide, yeah. The great thing about WordPress, I'm sure you know, is quite often, yeah. the Sims within the dashboard just yeah. choose yeah. 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 So yeah. imagine you have a WordPress site, and forgive me for those that may not know what we're talking about, what, if you have a WordPress website, you, unlike <coughs> standing FBML, you can, you can change the width to 520, then boom, suddenly you've got your correct width site, admittedly on an external web page, now you can just create your application for your iframe, what we're about to do, and then link that to this website, and you're this is that's it. Sorry, I missed the question. Go white, Steve. <coughs> I was going to say, I was going to ask the exact same question. Don't work about that. But if you've got a, a nice web, um, uh, WordPress site up there that's, I don't know, 960 wide or, or sure. something, would you then recreate that as a secondary site to the smaller width? Great question. My answer would be yes. Because so, in effect, you